Growing up Catholic, I grew up in a creedal religion. There's a creed, there's a dogma. You are told what the foundations and the principles of that religion is. Coming to UU, which is a covenantal tradition, was something that was completely foreign to me. And so when I explain what UU is to people, I start with that. I say it's a covenantal tradition and what that means to you is kind of up to you. I refer sometimes to the seven principles, although I can only recite two of them. One is, for, one is respect the inherent dignity and worth of every person, and the other one is something along the lines of, it is up to you to conduct a free and responsible search for truth and meaning. And that's the one that really resonates with me. That's the one that kind of weighs heavy on me and kind of makes me go, oh, I have, I have a say in this. I get to decide what that means. I also have a responsibility to decide what that means and not only to define it, but also to live it. So that one's powerful to me because I think coming from a religion where everything was told to you and you were given guardrails and you were given boundaries, all of a sudden those are taken away. It's up to you to decide how you want to live your life. I like the, the thought from Emerson that says um, everybody's relationship with the divine should be a unique and original experience. And I think being part of a creedal religion takes that original experience away. And you inherit what people are telling you to believe. You're inheriting your experiences from your parents and from their grandparents and from generations of, ahead of you that don't necessarily resonate with you. So having the responsibility to conduct that search yourself is a complete departure from anything that I was told to believe. And it resonates with me because it's not something I thought you could actually do.